welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited today because we're going to the charity shop. I haven't done a vlog for ages, so I'm looking forward to taking you along for the day. We're gonna go to the charity shop. I've got a certain thing in mind that I need to find, and I know that the charity shops are gonna be an amazing place to find it. So I like to go in with a bit of a plan so I don't get distracted by all the really cool things in the charity shops. Uh, but I'm gonna take you along with me. I haven't done a vlog for so long. I've done loads of like sit-down videos, finance videos, reviews, and things like that. But I love taking you to the charity shops because I always love watching these videos, like thrift with me videos, to see what people find, because there's al always so many good bargains in the charity shop. As you know, I've recently been using Whatnot to buy clothes, so I thought I would do a quick Whatnot haul for you, because if you love charity shops and thrifting and pre-loved clothes, this is a really good place to buy really nice pre-loved items and new items. I've got a few selection here to show you guys. I found some amazing bargains on Whatnot. If you don't know what Whatnot is, I have done a couple of explainer videos, so I'll link those in the description bar. Essentially, it's like a car boot in your pocket. If you love thrifting and secondhand finds, there are some amazing bargains to be had on Whatnot. And in fact, loads of new things as well. So I particularly love the clothes. They do do a wide selection of items. Let me show you some of these. So I thought I'd do a little, whoops, haul because this, look at this, Whistles dress from one of my favorite posts on there. They are called We Are, now I call them We Are Dead Stop, but I don't think they're actually called that. I think they're called we wear dead stock, that's the one. I'll put a list of my favorite sellers in the description bar for you. But this was £5.70. It's a brand new Whistles dress, stunning. It's so pretty, it's got the little bit of uh, detail here, the ruching, thought that was really nice. I wanted to share that with you. The thing that fell off, I bought as a bundle, and I thought this would be so nice for a like a festival maybe it's actually inside out brand new sundays i think it's called um with this beautiful top shop skirt they actually did it as a bundle brand new as well so this i think was three pounds 80 such a good bargain like you can get so many amazing things on there they actually they had it as two different things and they were like this goes really well together and what i love about whatnot is you can chat to the sellers like you can literally be like oh what's that thing over there in the background can you show it to me i got this as well from daisy street brand new again i think this is around two pounds and what i love as well is because i tend to like i like certain sellers and when you buy more than one thing your shipping goes up incrementally so you're not actually paying more for the shipping um i also got this cardigan i think i showed this recently though this is a new look one, just a staple. This was a pound, a pound. What I love about Watch Not at the moment is that it's kind of like the beginning. So the prices are all really reasonable. You know, like some of the other platforms now that I've spoken about here, the pricing is getting very expensive. So it's way beyond charity shop pricing, whereas this is still like charity shop pricing or car boot sale pricing. So it just means that you can get those prices basically before everyone like catches on and gets the prices get a little bit more expensive but anyway i'll share a little bit more about whatnot further into the video but i thought i'd share a little haul with you for clothes because today i'm not gonna be looking for clothes but yeah we'll chat a little bit more about that if you haven't signed up i've got a 10 pound referral that i will link for you in the description bar which will give you a free 10 pound credit to try it out yourself free clothes who doesn't love that um and also if you do use whatnot then let us know in the comments what you, what you think about it, how you found it, um, what bargains you found on there. Uh, but anyway, let's get into the video. Let's go to the charity shops. I'm gonna take you along for the day. I'm really excited because as I said, I haven't done this for so long and I do love looking at what's in the charity shop. So I hope you enjoy the video. Let's go. I just arrived at my first charity shop. I've got my bags. Although I don't know if I should take them in with me because Mm, I like to have both hands free, so I might leave the bags here and then just have to carry everything out. I like to have my hands free, I've got my crossbody bag, um, and I've just had something to eat because you don't want to be going charity shop shopping, thrifting, um, on an empty tummy because you need that energy to do the searching. So I'm here, it's pouring with rain, it's not ideal conditions, we don't like it when it's raining and you have to go in and out of many shops, but I'm excited, so let's go thrifting. <laughs> Starting to think you might know me better than all of my friends 
joy in that one sorry I'm a bit dark in here I needed to get back anyway because I've bookmarked a whatnot show because there's a show that I was really intrigued about and um, basically if you want to watch a show but it's not on there and then you can bookmark it and then it will remind you when it's on um, you can also see if they have listed any items ahead of the sale as well because it sort of works in more of like an um, like a buy it now style but I wanted to see this show which is really intriguing it's like a bulk buy thing starting at a pound and what they will do if you can see there like they have loads of like bundles like the hat and I've just they look like amazing value so we have a 10k bundle for women at the moment so i thought that's going to probably be quite a good thing to show you they give you a bit of an example and you can ask questions on the screen you can ask them what size it is what um like brands it might have in it so there's lots of different ways of like communicating with the buyers which is what i love and obviously you get the giveaways as well um when you are watching a show if you follow the seller you can get involved in the giveaways that they run throughout the shows so it's a really nice kind of like community and you end up like getting to know them i did a video all about how to set up your whatnot account if you wanted to do that and how to obviously be a seller how to buy things um that don't forget you can get that 10 pound referral credit if you are new to whatnot and i'll pop that on the in the description bar for you so it gives you 10 pound just to try it out see what you think of it anyway on to the next one
I didn't tell you what I was looking for. But let me just tell you, I tried three charity shops and none of them had what I was looking for. How is that possible? I thought this was like such a key thing to get at the charity shop. So basically what I want to do in our dining room is, you know where the TV is next to the dining room table? Underneath it, I have been looking since we moved into our house two and a half years ago, can you believe that? For a sideboard, but I couldn't decide what color I wanted, what style I wanted, whether I wanted wood, whether I wanted blue to like feel like it continues on to the kitchen through the kitchen um and what kind of top i wanted anyway so i've been looking for one in the sale there are some out there but they're very expensive so i'm basically waiting for a sale i think i know the one i want now i think it's going to be blue so that it looks almost like the kitchen like extends through to the dining area so I, I've got that in my mind. And what I want to do is cover the whole top of it in plants. I saw it in my friend's house and she had it and it looked so good. And I think with the contrast, like with the blue and the green with the flowers or the uh, plants, it looked really nice. Anyway, long story short, I wanted to get loads of pots to put the plants in. They had no pots, none. They had vases, but no pots. So it's almost back to the drawing board. So. I will not be defeated. I also am looking for a hat because I want a summer like sort of straw hat. Onwards and upwards to the next one. I'm not gonna give up, there's gonna be some. So I've just come to the next one. This is actually more of like a furniture shop. It could go one of two ways. It could be that there is more here than there was in the last one because it's like furniture. I don't know, I'm, I'm wishful thinking now. But anyway, let's go in, it's raining still. People in therapy are often there to deal with people in their lives who won't go to therapy. I have a job, it's actually quite fulfilling. Though my hairline is thinning, I barely do anything else. I read several books, I do meditation, walks in the woods, a new dusty. to see pictures in here because I have been looking for pictures for our lounge for so long and they're really hard to come by in the charity shops. I just didn't really want to buy them new for this room um, and I love this like gold frame style. These are only three pounds each as well so hopefully there'll be some nice ones in here. Some days I wish I had a relationship status then in the lounge but mostly we hang out in the dining room kitchen area I wonder if I could upcycle this so much of it 30 pounds because it's kind of got like the same style as our dining table with the slatted bit it's all solid pre-loved haul I did at the beginning of this video because I have had zero luck. In there was a really nice coffee table but I don't think the legs would go with the decor we've got so I was thinking of maybe upcycling it but I just don't think it's going to work. 
Um, and as I left, I saw that beautiful cabinet, the glass with like little stained glass, that was 95 pounds. Again, I just don't know where we'd put that. Like it could go in the, when you walk into the kitchen room, but that's sort of quite a high traffic area. And I don't know if it get knocked. Um, so yeah, not much luck so far. One. I got one thing. Um, this one's from Habitat, and um, it was a pound. So it's a quite. It's not very big though. I was, I was just. I can't. Would you have thought they would have loads of pots in the charity shop? I don't know. I just felt feel like they would have done, but clearly they don't. Um, but yeah, not much luck today, unfortunately. My sixth charity shop, and I didn't find, no, seventh charity shop, and I still didn't find any pots, which is such a shame. I've got this vision, and I can't, anyway. Um, I did get this, which is so sweet, for our little gallery wall in the lounge. Just looking for, like, individual different things. It was two pounds, and um, I think it's so detailed. You see all the plants in there, they, like, move around. So I thought that was lovely. And then I treated myself to a chocolate twist in the supermarket because I'm hungry now, very, very hungry. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna leave this video here. I've done like seven different charity shops, not very much luck, but you win some, you lose some. Um, don't forget if you are interested in checking out Whatnot, you can get the £10 referral in the description bar. I'll leave the link for you, free £10 just to see what you think of it. Let me know if you do use it, if you love it as well. Let me know if I should be brave enough to do a live show. Um, and yeah, hopefully you guys will find some bargains on there as well. I love a pre-loved, thrifted item, but from the comfort of the sofa, would have had much more luck looking on there than I did in the charity shops today. But anyway, thanks for being here with me today and I will see you in my next video. Take care, bye.